Well, it's the next day. We survived the Chi Chi Club extravaganza and Toga, Toga, and now we're in the recovery mode. Nobody's diving today. And Beverly's in here shopping for Hawaiian shirts. Ooh, kind of like that. It's an extra, well, it's a large. Let's see if we can find Beverly. There's Beverly. Oh, that's what I found, Ray. Hmm? A bikini? For Labor Ooh, Day. Yeah. That's cool. I like that. Stars and Stripes Forever. It's awesome. And at nighttime, you, the flag has to come down, right? <laughs> that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Only you would think of that. <laughs> okay, here we are. Back in Catalina, Avalon. We're going to walk out to the reef point where uh, there are 200 scuba divers waiting 20 minutes to walk into the water. We decided to pass on that. It seems as though everybody else has as well. And, oh, look, Olaf's ice cream. We've been told this is the best ice cream in all of Catalina. We may have to stop by on the way back. Oh, looks yummy. They make their own homemade cone. Smells really good and too. It really smells too good. Too bad, you know, you get sound, you get video, you get pictures and colors, but look at the you boats. don't get smells. Look at the boats. Isn't that nice? It's a busy day here in Avalon Harbor. And there's the casino. We'll walk over there. And there are a lot of folks here just taking up the sand. And they come here at 6 in the morning and stake out their, their uh, spot. It's not the greatest Sunday today, though. I mean, soul day. Okay. Well, we'll come back and visit you later when we get over to Casino Point. That... See you later, alligator. Okay, bye. A little different perspective here on Avalon Harbor, Catalina. Still a lot of boats. Here's the casino. There's Beverly. Let me zoom in on Beverly. Whoa! There's Beverly's tongue. We'll see that tongue later tonight. A little windy out here today. It doesn't seem to be discouraging anyone. I didn't know she was but I think We are now at Casino Point, Catalina. And you can tell this is a dive area. And I've been diving here many, many times. But they made this great addition. They put stairs, which I have not ever used but it makes it so much easier getting in and out. Otherwise, you'd have to climb over the wall. You'd walk down this preface of boulders and rocks that wasn't even smooth. Oh, that was a part of the challenge, And then you'd have to go out and stand on one of those rocks. Real men and when, do. They, when the wave would come in, you'd jump in before you fell onto a boulder. Did you ever fall onto a <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I bumped a few. And then <coughs> getting out was really tough. You'd come up here and then grab a hold of a rock and then the surf would kind of churn, take you out and grab you in and pound you while you try to get on your knees and crawl up the hill. That was life we didn't in, the, do the in, the, in the golden days, right? Yeah, right? this is cheap diving. <laughs> it's a nice dive area. There's not lots to look at other than Right at that buoy down there. I'll zoom in on it. And that's where I did my app, my very first deep dive. Right below that buoy. Hey. Right <laughs> below that buoy is a sunken ship that hey. 
has been sunken since like 1920 or so. It's just a part of a shell. You can't even really tell that it's a boat, but it's at 90 feet. It's one of the things to look at when you're out here. Other than that, it's just more of the same. It's little Garibaldi's. I had an interesting night diving experience here. I came out, I was just swimming along, there was four of us, and all of a sudden I thought the other two guys were, my, my dive partner went ahead of me, and I'm looking back and I see lights, and I thought, well, there's the other two guys. I went, swam fast, grabbed my partner, brought him back to where I saw the two lights and found out it was somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> I had managed to find some other night divers. You were a real panic diver. That was, you know, this is a nice little place to have a snack after you've been diving. You've seen a one, they even have live entertainment today. Top name bands in Catalina. Slimy in the boat, blowfish. Excited to see me? There he is. I dropped him off at the ice cream store. And he got his ice cream and he left me. He probably ate all of it already. Let's see how much he has left. Yeah, he has. He ate the whole thing already. I did not. It's just I just worked on the top. Oh my god, you ate the whole thing Here. already. There's five thousand. I've been trying to convince Beverly this is really the Greek islands. And these people, instead of Spanish, they're speaking Greek. But I don't think she's buying into that. There's my shirt. They hung up another one. There's Beverly's bathing suit. going to shop again. Well, I like that bathing suit better, but I think it's really important that we match. And you wouldn't look good in that. I don't think so. Here's our coffee place in the morning. Newspaper reading place. There's the market. Sort of like New Orleans here. Mm -hmm. Here we are. The bonds. Okay. I don't know. 
I think we ought to say goodbye. We'll see you on the boat. You're lining up on the yellow painted line. On the there we are. Side, gate number one. There's the Dana Point Avalon Two Harbors Explorer. Left side of gate number one, beneath the Commodore Lounge line. On the yellow line? You have to cross the yellow line? You're not on the yellow line. <laughs> Here we are in the Starship. We finally made it. Janet got us an upgrade. Janet is the... She flirted with a guy in the bar last night and you got us all upgraded. You know what it was? He was actually trying to pick up on Tom. I said, you know if you'll settle for a girl instead, you know. Okay, well that's a good idea. Well that's cool. Well, thank you for whatever you guys did. Thanks, Tom. You gave him an upgrade and what? So here we are. This is the Commodore Lounge. All inclusive. We've got cocktails, free sex, everything. Not quite the same program, but here we are, folks. Another one of the private scuba, private charters here and the upgraded jet fleet. Hi, Ray. Now it's on. It is? Say hi, Beverly, again. Hi, Beverly. The little red light is there. Well, it says REC. It does? Oh, okay. Well, I trust you then. It's going. I can read Handycam 3749. Yes. So we'll here we so. are on the Catalina Express, Ray. Did you have a nice trip here? Yes, I did. I really enjoyed myself. Catalina? Yeah. Even though I had to be a little bit more mellow on this trip than I would have normally been because I'm recovering from major herpes infection on my body. Oh, chicken pox. Oh, otherwise known as chicken pox. Right Chinese chicken pox. Which are different than chicken pox in the United States. Oh, we got the chicken the pox. And uh, I had to get sun back on my body and uh, but I just couldn't handle all of the activity, drinking, oh, wow. dancing, Did you enjoy diving. Your diving. Did you enjoy your diving? Oh, the diving was excellent. The first yes. dive, yes, it was. In fact, I got to tell you that you know, I've been diving maybe 25, 30 times in Catalina. This was by far the best dive I've made in Catalina. The water was the warmest. The clarity was the best. There's great. Uh, vegetation and animal life. Saw lobster and all, you know, some of my favorite Garibaldi's I saw. And uh, it was really one of the better dives. And, and, Beverly, and Beverly was happy too because she wasn't freezing her ass. Yeah, I really enjoyed the first dive. And the boat was nice. It was, they had a lot of divers, but it wasn't crowded and they accommodated you very well. Had a nice lunch on the boat. Really cool. Well, thank you very much. Yeah, and, and the toga party was just really cool, too. I mean, just walking down the street and have everybody stare at you and hoot at you. Well, we really especially nice. enjoyed watching you uh, filming those whip, that man and woman kissing. Oh, yes, that when was a good When you flashed that little boy. Yeah, yeah, a little flash. That was very in character for you. That's good. A little flash for that little boy just gave him a little additional insight on what really goes on in life. Well, we're all happy you weren't so, arrested. I am happy I was not arrested, yes. Well, okay, That would have been goodbye, embarrassing. Ray. That would have been a funny, embarrassing moment that we could have shared on some future trip. It would have been very trip. costly for you, I And guarantee. it would have been costly and probably, you know, lost my job and, you know, been in the papers and my family would have... Bye. Bye. Okay. Here we are. Hi, Beverly. Catalina Express. 
about your dive trip? I was warm. I had a brand new dive suit that was custom made. You, you look Ride hot. Did you get a picture of it?